Okay, here's a lovely question about confidence intervals. And part A is three juicy marks for getting unbiased estimates of the mean and variance. This is S1 stuff. Okay, and all you need is to put the values in your calculator and know which buttons to press to get your mean and your unbiased estimate of the variance. Don't forget it's variance, not standard deviation, so that should tell you to do something. Uh, three easy marks for just calculator work. Then we've got a confidence interval, and there are two kinds of confidence, confidence interval. One is where you use a Z number, and the other is where you use a T number. And the difference between the two is, are you using a sigma, a population standard deviation, or are you using an S, a sample related standard deviation? And it should be clear what you're using. Sigma gives you a Z. S, you need to use a T distribution. Use the appropriate table. The recipe for confidence interval is either is X bar plus or minus either T or Z times the standard error, which is either S over root N or sigma over root N for the Z distribution, and that should be five easy marks. Your notes should make it clear when to use sigma and Z, or when to use 